What's up, everybody? We are back again with some more Stellar Blade. We are here in the main hub, which is, uh, what is this place called? Zion or something like that? Uh, we're gonna go ahead and travel to the Wastelands now, so... Just to recap of what we, what we did last time is we pretty much cleared out the area that we that you start in, faced that boss in there, and then we made it here and we kind of just did some exploring here, picked up some side missions, didn't do any of them, learned more about um, this world, the lore about it, met the prophet, me it kind of seems like technology has taken over the world and is kind of just fooling these people, and it seems like some other people believe that as well. Um, We'll see what's going on, going on though, as we keep going. So we also got this ability right here. So now we have a gun. And how do you... I forget, how do you change this? Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, whatever. We'll figure it out as we go. Um, but yeah, so for now, let's just go ahead and go to the wasteland. Also, do want to apologize for my last stream. Turns out I kind of had some difficulty with my mic and I didn't realize it towards pretty much the end. Um, it's a bit of a bummer. But for now, I think, unless we want to do any of these side missions while we're here, let's see. If we do this. Check on the client's wife. I mean, I guess we can do this since we're here. Uh, we picked up this note. Notes on Eve Protocol 1. Scavenger, uh, Scavenger Ian's first note on the Eve Protocol. I accidentally encountered a dying angel during my treasure hunt in the wasteland. Though her claim was mostly preposterous, I believe it, it is worth documenting. The Eve Protocol Mother Sphere's plan to exterminate all Nativas and take back Earth, I couldn't believe myself but to ask, are you out of your damn mind? When she br briefly told me of the plan, who in the world would think sending only a few airborne squad members to do the job is a solid plan? We all know the cursed colony extinction. If Mother Sphere wants Nativas out of the picture, dropping a few chunks from the moon will do the trick. You think she won't do it because we will all die as well? Really? She abandoned us and left us here like a bag of scraps decades ago. Now she's being merciful all of a sudden. Alright, whatever. Let's see. So it says the cradle is right here. Let's see. If I enter the name in the life support device. All status favorable sleep mode. Sleep mode is activated and only the necessary functions required for minimal life support are running. Energy is needed for physical activation. A message from the sleeper. Don't come looking for me. Run away, you idiot. What's this message? Oh, sweet. We can just travel straight to the bulletin board. That's nice. Rather than having to walk all the way back. All right, so now what do we do? We check this. This facility is in need of repairs. Anyway. All right, so I'm able to complete this. Ooh. All oh, more of these come. Yeah, let's let's keep doing some of these. These are kind of fun. Ouch. Plastic cards, volume five. Where are you going? Don't leave me behind, please. Hello, my little treasure. Glorious Mother Sphere, why did you teach me how to open my bird cage? I see. Then, please touch me last. Touch me one last time. Live well without me, safely, peacefully. Got you. I'm going- I'm never going to let you go. Alice, don't do this. This is all your fault. The failing pump, the respirator, my sad heart, all of it. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. 
That's like a little story that we're following there with the Plastic Heart series. Da, 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 da. But it's actually really nice. I'm actually enjoying it doing these little things. Cat, but now it's a cold, dead body. What do I do? I travel back now. Ooh. Are we gonna have to break the news? Looks like there's a lot of activity. Alright. Oh, nice. Alright, let's see. I don't want to do this one yet because I'm actually... I don't know. This is a puzzle. I'm not exactly sure how this one works. We'll see. Missing husband. My husband is an engineer who did maintenance on the cradle. He suddenly quit his job without saying anything. There's not much time left in his body cell, so I tried to be understanding. But he refused to enter the cradle until the very end. He never told me why. My husband hasn't come home for several days. I looked everywhere but couldn't find him. I need to find him before the, his body cell runs out. Can't have left Zion. If you know anything about my husband Matthew's whereabouts, please leave me a message. All right, let's see what this is all about. Oh, what's this? How dull. Interesting. What do we got here? Gwen, I will never forget you. Okay. Hey. Oh, it's you. What do you mean, dull? Oh, I guess you heard that. Well, I guess I'm I did. Sorry. I mean, you just said it right in front of my face. I wasn't asking for an apology. I just wanted to know why you said that. What is this place? This is my shop, Gwen Hair Salon. I'm Kasim, the hairstylist. Hair. I style your hair so you feel better and confident. Your hair looks great. It's full of potential. But that potential is hidden at the moment. That's why I said it is dull. Is that so? Are you saying you can make my hair less dull? Of course. But I don't have the proper tools with me right now. Those so-called scavengers stole them. I can't run a business without my tools. But then they probably just threw them away. Those tools would be useless to them. Thrown away? Where? Things like that usually end up in the landfill in the wasteland. Okay. I can look for them. In return, you will style my hair. In Sounds the wasteland. Good. I'm missing three items. Scissors hair dryer, and hair straightener. Understood. I'll be waiting here, Angel. Nice, pretty cool. An engineer in a place like this. Oh, the body cell is turned off. Matthew's memory. Nobody believes my, my words. We are being deceived by a false prophet. Cradle isn't owned by humans, it's owned by the Nativas. They're trying to turn us into Nativas. You wait and see. Soon, regret and despair will conquer Zion. Damn. This is my client's husband. There's no love lost between him, Orkel, and the Cradle. Yeah, man, I'm loving the lore. It's really these missions are adding a lot to like what I think about this world. So I, I'm enjoying it. These are nice and quick. These aren't taking too long or anything. We get gold out of it. Looking for my brother. My name is Melina. 
I'm looking for my younger brother, Aaron. A reward for anyone who finds him. He's of average height, kind of plain looking. He's really nice. He used to live in a small warehouse in Upper Zion, hauling junk around the scrap planes. The Sentinels say that Aaron is under investigation and refuse to help find him. I don't think the Sentinels are even capable of finding him. But I'm out of options, so here I am, putting this up on the bulletin board. If you see this, please help. Alright. Take care of this one now. Oh, there's a bunch of books in here. Book of Faith and Wisdom, 2, 1, one through 4. All wisdom is born here in this land. The Great Father designed Mother Sphere, and the Mother created us. Though the colony extinction left us among ashes and dust, remember that the providence, the providence is thesis, thesis, antithesis, and thesis. Interesting. <laughs> Mother Sphere is wise, and she will give us salvation in the crisis of impending doom. Therefore, we will do Mother Sphere's bidding on Earth as it is in Heaven. We will return to the Cradle. Uh, it's fixing books around there or what? Stealing books. Okay. The lost 72 years. Three. Two through one. The Natibas defeated us, and so some remained on the surface, and some returned to the colony under orders from Mother Sphere. Still don't know how she decided who stayed and who left. Those who returned to the colony, colony were often called Heaven's Royalty, became subjects of hatred. But as I wrote before, Mother Sphere is nothing more than an aggr aggression of knowledge and will. It doesn't favor one over the other. Everything she does is based on rationality, alone. This may come as difficult to accept for some people, but that is another matter. We all face hardships here on the surface. Strife and envy drove citizens to hate those who returned to the colony. This much is clear. Citizens of Zion hate those who returned to the colony because they believe they have been deprived a life of comfort in the colony. After all, the colony is free of constant threats, but I can't help myself but wonder, is the colony really the paradise they think it is? Just adding more to the story or to this world. I want to know what the colony is like. How to speak with style. Do you think you are too serious? Do you think you can't lead a conversation? And we suggest that you throw a little joke to lighten up the mood. Example, what is, what is my car's favorite meal of the day? The answer is break fast. Seems like a great idea. I must try it when preaching to people. Crossed out. It was a lie. And Atibas eat you alive, you fraud. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually. Tried the joke out. Got no laughs. Had tough crowd. Oh, I did not mean to do that, but since we're here. Curse the Heaven's Royalty. Decades have passed since the final war, but we still suffer in this cesspit of monsters and sandstorms called the surface. Mother Sphere promised us salvation. She did not keep her promise. Did she ever send us an evacuation shuttle or a rescue team? Mother Sphere does not lie. This means there's another mastermind behind this injustice. We all know who they are. I curse the heavens royalty. Judgment be upon those who hide in the colony, laughing at us for our misery. They deserve to be nowhere but in hell, where they twisted Mother Sphere's will. So obviously you can see the hatred from people here in the surface to people who are in the colony. What the heck? There's a path right here? Really? 
What is this thing? It looks so strange. Oh, that's a can. In the past, it was used as a container for electrolyte solutions. A can? I like it. I can read a variety of data from this. It isn't much, but I can still feel traces of memories in it. It's a description or an advertisement for the electrolyte solution. Funny seeing you so interested in some old item. Well, they're kind of pretty in their own way. But if you're that worried about it, why don't I make a cabinet to store them? All right then. Ooh. As long as it's not a burden for you. Oh, this is easy as pie for the one and only Lily Artemis. <laughs> I'll prepare it right away. Let's make a collection together. Thank you, Lily. Angel, you'll need useful information in order to operate outside of Zion. Did you know that there is an information dealer in the city? I think it'll be worth it for you to meet that person, despite their character. I've met them already. Uh, uh I mean, didn't I do this already? Or let's just go back. I did meet her already. Good to see. You. Hello. I much prefer you to PS. Got her out. Oh, honey. That's a weird thing. <laughs> Looks all right. God damn it. Oh, they're both out of here. Okay. Oh my gosh, if I would have known that, I wouldn't have even done that one. Alright, let's see. Let's do this one then. You enter the correct answer into the input device installed at the elevator, leading to the presence chamber. I'll give you a prize. Then I think this guy has a mission for us or something. You must be the angel. Sorry, but can you spare a moment? What's going on? I normally wouldn't get a stranger involved in Sentinel's business, but I'm worried about my comrades and I can't afford to send a search party. What happened? As you know, Natibas are unpredictable creatures. Finding a new variant is not even a big deal, as long as we can handle it. This particular new variant recently appeared in the wasteland, so we've been keeping an eye on it. But one of my scout teams has not returned to Zion yet. A new variant, you say? Yes, a formidable monster. Its entire neck and shoulders had evolved into a weapon. I'll send you the coordinates. There's an abandoned oil storage facility in a remote corner of the wasteland. The scout team was guarding the area. So, you want me to find those sentinels? Yes. Thank you. Whoa, oh, oh, whoa, I never agreed upon this. Let's activate this waypoint. Go in the right direction? Yeah, okay, perfect. Gonna be right here. Okay. Now let's figure out the puzzle. I'm gonna bust out the calculator. See if I can find something. Some type of pattern with these numbers. So it's not four times seven times eight, because that's just way too low of a number. What if we do or to the power of seven and we'll take that oh this might be too big of a number take that number to the power of eight nope that is way too big oh i found it i yep i found it okay so this is what it is well at least i, I know the first number 28 comes from four times seven is 28 Seven, okay, so four, and I know that because 
the one below that one, 9 times 3 is 27. The one below that one, 6 times 2 is 12. So 5 times 6 is going to be 30. Writing this number down just so I don't forget it. So the next number is going to be 7 times 8 is 56. 3 times 5 is 15. 2 times 7 is 14. So 6 times 7 is uh, 42. Then the last number, 84, how do you get the last number? You just add them up? Yep. Yeah, you just add those two numbers up. So in this case, it'd be 30 plus 42, 72. Oh man. The, only, the feeling of solving a puzzle there's nothing like it. <laughs> you just feel so good about yourself. Alright, three, zero, four, two, seven, two. Too easy. Oh, whoa, whoa there you don't get too cocky. Looks like there's a lot of activity. All right, let's take a look at some of the stories of the citizens. Dunzos. All right, there's two more. Because I say there's two, more, two more because this one goes into the, the wastelands. Lost device. Hello, not too long ago, I lost a device with my precious journal in the caves on the way to the wastelands. It's very precious to me, so I need to I need to find it. Since it's my di diary, you can't read it ever, never, ever. I look forward oh. to my way to the wasteland. So we'll accept that one and this That's one too. My wife, I help? my wife, my wife Donna is missing. Someone saw her heading out to the wasteland, but that only makes me nervous. My wife always hated leaving Zion. Why would she think to leave it now? She just feels so ominous. Please help me find my wife. She can't have gone very far. Cool. So all three of these are in the wasteland. I believe. Okay, so this one's not exactly... So this one's not exactly at the wastelands, but right below it. Oops. I mean, just on the way, like it said, on the way to the wastelands. So not in the wastelands. Is this it? It was submerged for so long. I wonder if it's still functional. I should check it out. We should say not to. This goes against regulations. I've simply come to clean your chambers. Is that really the only reason why you're here in my room? I don't understand. I'm simply a humanoid maid. That's right. The below three. That's why I like you. And your your sturdy actuator and slender cables. What is this? The identification codes match. Weird. Weird stuff in this game. Valuable cargo. I left my cargo behind in the middle of the scrap planes in the wasteland because of a damn nativa. Still can't move my left leg. So I'm putting out a request for someone to get back to me. Cargo contains part that parts that are needed to maintain and repair the cradle. Be found in the oil storage storage facility in the scrap planes. All right, there we go. So now we officially have all three of these. And go to the wastelands. Angel, I didn't come. You don't got anything, right? Oh, that's a weird thing. To <laughs> yeah. So now we're good to go. 
Oh, I don't know how I didn't see this. The last 72 years, one. 72 years have passed since Mother Sphere's declaration of a new humankind. As the, as the last historian of Zion, I, Luther, will document and comment on the last 72 years of our history to let our descendants know how we lived with no home. My esteemed fellow citizens believe that Mother Sphere is a god. However, just like all of us, Mother Sphere has the mind of a human. Though her cogn cognitive ability and inten intelligence far super supersede those of an ordinary human, it is utterly wrong to define her as a supernatural being. And what is Mother Sphere? It is knowledge and will in and will incarnate. We serve the la largest database in the history of mankind, and then will be born, and then will born from the database. And the will born from the database. Sorry. The declaration of a new humankind is not some revelation. It is simply her concluding that we can be categorized as humans. That is the premise of this book. Hmm, interesting. Mother Sphere. Can't wait to learn more about that. of Altus Lavoir. Let's go. I am excited to start this new area. The camp doesn't have power. Oh, well, let's see. Looks like a good amount of the camp's energy is being supplied by nearby areas. I think there's an issue with the supply network. What can we do about it? <sighs> this is gonna be tricky. Oh god. Outside of Zion, there's a solar tower that supports energy links to nearby facilities. It seems like there might be a problem with the tower. Going to have to go and check. All right. Let's also go ahead and check out our missions. Right? Think it makes sense to do that? Miley face. boost right there and his memory this is obsession is getting worse if I tell Donna what if Donna gets hurt Donna called and said she wants to meet I think I should tell her before it's too late okay Donna's memory Amanda are you trying to seduce Chris you're supposed to be my only friend. You know how hard I worked for this happiness. I'll never forgive you. I'll kill you, you hag. It's so sad. And all because of a misunderstanding. Damn. Alright. Take a look at the map again. Alright, so this is the main thing that I'm doing, right?
But yeah, let's go here. there. We jump down here. Number two, any angels have been spotted from the colony. What is their purpose? Phantasm and distrust and distrust are not permitted. Zion must stand firm and keep a close watch. According to the Set Niles, angels from the colony have descended and have been spotted around Zion. They have been conducting multiple operations over the years. This is the first time they have been active in pro active in prox in proximity of Zion. Angels are supposedly superhuman warriors alone can do the work of many, but their past battle records are unknown. I believe that they go through a cycle of tactical successes and strategic failures. Prophet Oracle requested that requested they be treated rationally, saying, Dion was not chosen for the colony, but we need to put, our si put aside our old grudges and walk alongside them as fellow humans. While some extremists argue that angels may be hostile, or that they may be the embodiment of Mother Sphere, we must display civic awareness and inspire the spirit of the community. Oh, what the? Can I sneak up on this thing? Yes, I can. Alright, so we're going that way. Let's go over here. You got something over here. Body. Citizen 439's re resignation. Take a hard long look. This land has no hope, and all that's left is pain and death. Earth's finished. My leg. My muscles won't listen to me. I can still go. I'm not far from Zion. Damn it. Can't feel my legs. Don't want to die. I'm scared. Oh, Jesus. Oh 
Oh my god, that move. Alright, facing two of those guys is tougher than facing one, obviously, but they made it a lot tougher. Got a fast travel right here, also. Oh, no power. Of course. Maybe I should just go ahead and go straight to, um. Well, I'm already here, though. What's over here? Oh. What the hell? Could use that. Yeah, let's just do that. Hold up. Oh my god. Please be it. Oh my god. I'm not ready for this. Oh wait, this is just one of those. Okay. Should be good. Oh my god. Hold. Oh my god. I just got hit. Dude, that is tough. Alright, yeah, that actually worked out super well. Oh my god, no it did not. Well, yes it did, but I just messed up. Okay, not too bad. Alright, we got it now for sure. Like I said, the key is actually just to pretty much run away from these things. Because when you're in the middle of all that, it is tough. And I hope this is it. If not, there's gonna be some BS right here. Oh, okay. Impact type exospine. Alright, there we go. We got some skill points too. Good to know, good to know.
Oh, I almost dodged them all. God damn, these things are so annoying. Got a bunch of trap. They use like the treasure as bait. It's been 42 days since the journey to the orbit elevator began. It seems to be right in front of our eyes, but we can't reach it. I want to go to space too. Oh, let's see. Where are we? Yeah, we're pretty much here now. I don't know if I want to finish exploring this area first. Let me see real quick. That answers the question. Alright, let's see if we can sneak up on this guy again. At least there was something over here. Oh! Trap again! Can't stop. There's nothing for us here but death. You have to get to Zion before it gets light outside. Shit, the sun's coming up. Run. Quickly. Move the goalpost back. It's a dead end. I can just dash along the wall. Ah, shit. Nice. Approaching a marked wall will let you run to the wall. Press X while running to kick wall and jump. Oh my god. Well, that didn't work. Let's 
scrap planes. Is this the place Kassim mentioned? Yes, it is. It's an absolute treasure trove of all manner of junk. Only problem is that it's far too big. Anyway, let's get started. Okay, scissors, hair dryer. What? Listing off that? Why oh, is that nearby? Oh yeah, out oh, here. All oh, down there. Yeah, right, let's get that real quick. Scissors. That's the only thing here. Oh, yeah. Scissors. This does. Right, that's not bad at all. Got the dryer. Why didn't she grab onto it? Get in here. Gotta get up there somehow. Oh, okay, this is how we get in here. Take, carry, put down. Oh. There's the bike. Adam, I've located the bike. I see. She must have left it behind when she ran away. And it looks to me like the drones have already picked it clean. Nothing to be done there. Dang. It would have been kind of cool if we rode the bike. Hmm. These kinds of trunks are usually only used by scavengers. I think this one belongs to Kaya. Good to hear. Okay. Go ahead and get it back. Oh, okay. The trunk. Alright, that should be it here. Just this right here.
Ooh. Oh, shoot. Three scissors dryer, all that. Come on, pick it up. There we go. It's the law of nature that all wounds heal with time. Earth. Earth is no exception. If only those damn Natibas would disappear, then Earth could heal. If they're going this way, we're going the wrong way. We don't want to do that, so let's go back. Yeah, and sorry if I keep opening this up. Just gotta check some things out, make sure I'm going the way I want to go. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Like right here, there's this crate. Ooh, but I don't have the passcode. Thing almost destroyed me. Alright, so I don't think I. Once again, I can't activate this. There's no power, right? Yep. So we are here now. What's in here? Human. What the heck? Oh, is this one of the missions? Oh, this is a new mission. What on earth are you doing here? Ah, it was you, Angel. Phew. I'm here on the Prophet's orders to inspect the plant and other facilities. I was about to head back, but I saw all these monsters. I barely managed to hide here. You already saved my life, but can I ask you a favor? Did you see a sentinel on your way here? No. You're the only person I saw. The thing is, a sentinel accompanied me here as a bodyguard. He shoved me in here to protect me from a nativa before running off to fight it. He's dead, bruh. He's I dead. Can't just leave without him. Wait here. I'll look around. Thank you so much, Angel. His name is Go. If he's alive, he should be around here somewhere. Oof. So it's this one right here. So we don't have to do it right now. Go ahead and focus on the main mission. I 
power to. Over there, that way. What's back here? We're gonna create a shortcut eventually. Crops die in the winter. Come back to life when spring comes. Right now, Earth is in its winter. When the winter is over, spring will come. Don't give up and keep fighting. Live on to enjoy spring for my sake too. So maybe we should actually come back and do this mission real quick. Yeah, let's go do it real quick. Right? It's this way? Yeah. There are no enemies nearby. Looks like a pretty good place to pick. Is this? Okay. Maybe we do that everywhere. Also, get, just take care of what's in here. Luke's memory. This is the place, but I can't swim at all. What do I do? Should I use a fishing rod? Help! I can't swim. Please, someone. He drowned. Oh, that blurry down here. Go's memory. As the prophet ordered, I opened the path to Altus Lavor. However, the monsters stopped me from returning to Zion. I hope my fellow fellow engineer is safe. And then, yeah, back. I think this has to be the sentinel. He must have lost his footing while fighting off the Nintiba. May your memories live on forever. Whoa. What the heck is this? What is this place? All this for a crate? No, and I don't even have the code. God damn.
we got another one of these things. Wonder what's gonna happen once we put every, all of these where we're supposed to go. Like a drop box. That was here. Wait, where did that drop? Oh, at the very beginning, okay. So now let's, I think that's everything here. Other than that like chest at the at the bottom of the ocean or at the bottom of this pond or whatever you want to call it. I think we got everything. Give him the chance. Oh. Hey, what do we got here? Chapter of Trial Six. They will come to save us who have been. They will come to save us who have been washed in despair. They will come with a sword of blood and wings of wrath. Oh, dear Mother in the heavens, take us back into your arms and carry on our memories. Interesting. And then the back kind of seems like it says, "Save us, save mankind." I think that's what it says. See if we can get up here and maybe do like an aerial attack. Where'd he go? There he is. So bad. Alright, were you were you at least guarding anything? Ah yes. Perfect. Let's go. That's huge, especially right now. <laughs> what the heck? Nah, I'm not even gonna go for that. Once again, we got one of these things, but can't even use it. Security code? No, but 
getting ourselves inside might prove to be a bit of oh no Alt, outsider okay this is the comrade right this is someone from Zion. you I'm Royal Guard Quiel. I'm under direct orders from Oracle to protect the ruins. Do you know this is a restricted area? Wait, wait, but we are here to do a favor for Oracle? Even so, I can't let anyone in who isn't qualified. Ah, uh, here we go. Qualified. If you manage to defeat me, I'll let you pass. Well, if that's the case. Well. What is that? Is she healing herself? She's done this. She's done this. Unless she has a second phase. Very good. I underestimated your ability to fight on equal footing with the Alpha Nativa. It was an honor to spar with you. We can enter now, right? Yes. Altes Lavoir has been contaminated by Nativas for a long time. No one has ever made it back alive. However, with you, I have hope. Okay. Uh, just quick comments about that fight, I guess. Uh, her moves are pretty predictable. I mean, if, if I had full, like, blood vials, or, blood vials, that's bloodborne. Uh, blood, like, full potion, HP potion, I don't think I would have struggled at all. I was just kind of tripping a little bit, because I knew I was a little bit low on that. The blade stopped working all of a sudden. Huh. The drone scan isn't working either. Hold on. This is bad. There's an unusual electromagnetic security field disrupting the system. There should be nativas around here. Ah, equipping the drone is still possible. Same goes for shooting at range. I guess we should thank Lily for that. That's more than enough. Entering now. So, hold on. I'm a little confused about something. Oh my god. I thought this one that I was doing was to reboot the, the Wasteland's power supply. That whole time, I could have... No, I messed up big time. I think we gotta do this before we... we Go back. 
Oh man, I can't believe I messed that up so bad. That's definitely the first thing you had. Like, he literally told you, like, that's the first thing you want to do when you come here. So the fact that I messed that up, it's huge. Okay, we'll go ahead and end it here. And yeah, we'll end it on a big realization that I messed up. <laughs> so next time, I'm going to go ahead and first thing is I'm going to go activate the solar power because I don't really want to. Even though I've already gone a good amount of this area, without it, I still need it. I need the campsites. Um, they're just a good resting point, because right now I literally don't have any resting point. So, we'll go ahead and do that. It's such a bummer though, that the only way to do it is going to be going all the way back. Oh, I forgot to talk to this guy, so, I mean, I'll do that. But literally, I had to take the long way back. Oh man, I am not looking forward to that. Hopefully I can go through that super quick. For now, thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Please like and subscribe. And peace.